Chaparral Vulcan Air Defense System meets this Army need of forward battle area protection against low-flying enemy aircraft. This highly mobile and versatile tactical system features a supersonic infrared homing missile and a rapid-fire, high-performance Vulcan gun system mounted on the existing M113 family of vehicles. The vehicles are powered by diesel engines with automatic transmissions that will move the Chaparral and Vulcan along at up to 40 miles an hour with a cruising range of 300 miles. Aside from being air transportable, they are capable of swimming inland bodies of water. The fire control is based on a newly improved lead computing site using data from a range-only radar. The Chaparral and Vulcan gunners are alerted by the advance warning from the forward area alerting radar, FAR, which is integrated with the two fire units. It is capable of detecting moving targets at very low altitudes. Part of the gun itself was adapted from an existing aircraft mounted weapon. It is an electrically driven 20 millimeter cannon with six rotating barrels on the Gatling gun principle. To meet the special needs of airborne and air mobile units, there is still another version of Vulcan designed to be towed by any number of vehicles. The Chaparral missile, adopted from the Navy's Sidewinder 1C, is just under 10 feet long and weighs slightly less than 200 pounds. Four missiles are carried on the launch rails while traveling. Eight additional missiles are stored in the vehicle. The Chaparral normally carries a five-man crew in the passenger compartment. After the chaparral is driven into a tactical area, the blast shield is then positioned to protect the vehicle from effects of the missile firing. Each observer is equipped with a field telephone and deploys to an area providing a good, unobstructed view of potential targets. Section chief and the driver work as a team to coordinate pre-firing activities and monitor radio messages. The battle sequence is initiated when an observer locates a target and relays, using the clock system, appropriate information to the gunner. Typically, this information includes both azimuth and elevation coordinates. When the gunner sights the target, he proceeds to establish IR acquisition by slewing the mount. Using the sight reticle pattern superimposed on the target image, an audio tone is received to indicate target contact. The gunner begins the launch sequence by pressing the trigger on the control handle, thus generating the firing signal. As soon as the sequencing is complete, the final signal is received from the fire unit, initiating rocket motor ignition. Within a few milliseconds, the missile clears the launcher and flies under the control of its internal guidance system to intercept the target. Chaparral Vulcan, a powerful twosome, effectively combined to provide the Army with a forward area defense system that is mobile, reliable, and lethal.